Hey everybody, Economic Ninja here. Uh, do I want to do a really quick video on the Federal Reserve decision. It's going to be coming out pretty soon, probably within an hour of this video coming out. Uh, I saw an opportunity and I just want to let you guys know what I did. Uh, it's not financial advice, trading advice, but it's what I did. Uh, I went ahead and pulled the trigger on some Philharmonics, Silver Philharmonics, because uh, we just don't know which way this is going to go. And to be honest with you, I, I expect a lot of jawboning promises that don't ever end up happening because the Fed is backed up into a corner. The honest truth is they can't raise rates because if they do, they start to collapse certain parts of our economy worldwide, honestly. Um, and it would make the dollar so much stronger than other currencies. True, we'd get be able to sell a lot of dollars. Uh, but the thing is, is that's not where you want to be right now when the whole world is racing to debase. It's like the racing to debasing kind of thing where all countries are wanting to to lose value in their currency to become more competitive for uh, you know uh, exports. And um, so precious metals have been moving down. And I'm going to be putting a link to what I bought uh, in the description below if you guys want to check it out. And again, not financial advice because this could go down more. But the problem is all year we have seen massive, especially on silver, uh, prices over spot all in the industry because there's so much purchasing going on. So I've never in 11 years of being investing in precious metals have seen such a, an extended period of time where the price over spot is so high and shipments take so long. And so, um, so again, depending on this decision, markets can go up or down, right? But we've seen in the past, especially with silver, when the price drops dramatically, everyone races so fast to buy it, the price over spot explodes. And it's almost like, well, did I get a good deal or not? So considering that the price is down today, another couple percent almost, um, I think it was like down like 1.85%, right? As I hit record on this, um, there was a deal that I saw and I'll put a link to below to a clickable form. Uh, it's uh, Philharmonics one ounce 2021 Philharmonic coins they're gorgeous um for uh three dollars and sixty cents over spot so i had to give my little notes um so i pulled the trigger and bought a handful but the thing is too um you know if you're only buying a few when you look at the shipping costs it's yeah it's it depends like you know on orders like two thousand dollars or more it makes sense at that price um but yeah, if you can find them cheaper, go for it if you want to buy. But yeah, on these days where the price is dipping and we're now in the 21 handle, it could go lower, but I'm trying to figure out, okay, well, if it goes lower and increase, increases the demand for purchases, does the, the price over spot go up? And I, I did call um, the company and they said, it's got, we're still going to be out a couple weeks on shipping. So you can lock the price in. Everything's coming. It's just shipping is a little delayed with the holiday season and the demand right now. And I said, I don't mind because I know it's coming and they give you delivery confirmation. You know what day it's coming. So that's not a big deal to me. But I uh, called Mrs. Ninja and I said, what do you want to do? Do you want to lock in another purchase? Because we just don't know, you know, and, and uh, I don't want to be too cash heavy. So just want to let you guys know what I did. So I hope you guys are doing great. I can't wait to see you guys crush it in 2022. And I'm going to be honest with you, no matter where the market goes, we want to crush it. Why? Because we want to be prepared and not scared. All right, guys, that being said, the Economic Ninja is out.